company that, is, that, that has never granted a franchise should not be forced to do so. State Capitol looking more like a Tesla Motors showroom today. CEO Elon Musk arrived to deliver the keynote address to the Texas Transportation Forum. And the company's Model X concept, their newest on display in Austin. But currently, you cannot walk into any showroom and buy a Tesla anywhere in Texas. State law that protects dealerships means that you have to order a Tesla online. In addition to trying to change that, Musk had another revelation today. The California billionaire mentioned that Texas will most likely be the testing ground for his idea of the Hyperloop. This is the concept for a next-generation high-speed mass transit system. It could revolutionize travel. After potentially testing out the Hyperloop here in Texas, Musk wants to build the pod-like rail system from Los Angeles to San Francisco. A six-hour car ride would take just 35 minutes. But what will this mean for the future of Tesla cars in Texas? Well, that all depends on the legislature. The Hyperloop test could just be a peace offering to Texas, so Musk can sell Teslas directly to Texans. So I think it's just important for legislators to understand the right, the the original rationale for the law and why uh, it made sense, uh, you know, it, it, it you know, and, and was it was a just thing then, but is in fact an unjust thing now. I hope we hold the line in terms of not allowing them to sell directly to consumers, and uh, I think Texans deserve a lot better. I had to fly to San Francisco, California, to test drive a car, not because I bought a Tesla, but because I'm a Texan, and that's embarrassing. Musk says he's not seeking state money as an incentive for the Hyperloop test track project. However, he would be open to contributions from others. Elon Musk already has deep business ties in Texas. Last August, his company SpaceX officially announced that it plans to build a new rocket launch facility near Boca Chica Beach in Cameron County. That's about 20 miles east of Brownsville. The other spot is the SpaceX rocket test facility near Waco in McGregor. That location employs 250 people. This video from July 14th shows the launch of the SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket at Cape Canaveral, Florida. The Texas launch facility is expected to create 300 jobs and bring $85 million in investment into the local economy.